106 strike attack weapon system has demonstrated its performance in simulated tactical operations at sustained high speeds. 80 feet above the ground in the turbulent summer heat of Death Valley, California, it has proven itself at extreme high altitudes, 19,000 feet above its own design ceiling. In September 1959, an F-106 established an unofficial world speed record. It can carry internally any tactical weapon in existence, including conventional bombs, guided missiles, or special weapons. Its delta wing gives it stability at all altitudes and speed. It is the only aircraft built with full emergency cabin pressurization. Its cockpit is efficient, simple, with excellent visibility. Its engine is the J-75 Pratt & Whitney with afterburner. To the pilots who fly it, it is a pilot's airplane. To the men who maintain it, it is a mechanic's airplane. To the men who build it, it is a triumph. Here is a high-performance aircraft that employs revolutionary new manufacturing techniques and operational features that can be produced with great efficiency and cost savings. For manufacturing efficiency, the F-106 was designed to be assembled from symmetrical halves. This provides efficient access by assembly workers at all stations. Wiring, bracketry, and plumbing are installed in the sub-assemblies before mating into larger barrel sections. This permits great time saving in installation and checkout procedures. All major fixtures are optically controlled for very precise tooling tolerances. A precision telescope is used to establish exact lines of sight, which never vary, and which can be economically reproduced for additional fixtures. This reduces the hard master tooling formerly required by 90%, and reduces time required for cycle check of fixtures by 70%. At conveyor, manufacturing simplicity is demonstrated by the fact that all assembly buildings are of conventional construction. Major assembly areas are two-level main floor, mezzanine with overhead rail crane, and conventional assembly tools. No elaborate construction areas are necessary. In the sub-assembly areas, the Scotchweld bonding is accomplished. This revolutionary new bonding process makes possible integral wing fuel cells which do not leak and adds greatly to structural strength while reducing weight. Scotch weld tape is applied to fuel areas of the wing. The protective film is removed and the structural assembly completed. The subassembly is heat cured to permanently fix the bonding for years of maintenance free surface. Wing mating, a traditional bottleneck in aircraft assembly, is done without the use of fixtures by simply bolting the wing spars to forged fuselage bulkheads. During F-106 production history, not a single instance of misalignment or slowing of the production flow has occurred with this foolproof method. The F-106 incorporates many machined components, which reduces weight, increases strength and fatigue life, and improves quality and dimensional control. An F-106 wing spar, for example, is one piece, weighs 64 pounds. The conventional build-up method would involve 70 detail parts, 800 fasteners, and would weigh 94 pounds. Dynamic etching is another manufacturing plus factor in the F-106. Expensive pocketing, sculpturing, profiling, step milling, and tapering 
are all easily accomplished by chemically etching a mask area to predetermined depth, then stopping the etching process by special rinses. Dynamic etching eliminates machine stresses, marring, tool marking, and provides absolute uniformity of parts. Metal bonding and extensive use of honeycomb construction are further weight, time, and money savers in the construction of the F-106. The manufacturer of the F-106 employs hundreds of engineering, tooling, assembly, and production flow concepts, which were incorporated to make the F-106 economical and efficient to build. Over three years of extensive flight testing have proven the value and efficiency of the F-106 manufacturing methods. They are the result of thousands of engineering man-hours and an exhaustive development test program. The production plan for the F-106 has evolved from many years in designing, building, and flying Delta Wing aircraft. This experience and the perfected methods that have grown out of it is available now to aircraft manufacturers throughout the free world. Production line, flight line, firing line. The F-106 is ready.